where the little lines are, that's actually suction. Now, you're not putting any water down. All you're doing is sucking whatever's left in the actual carpet. So you go back and forth. On this, um, when you're doing the, the suction side, go a little slower, because it'll suck up even more, even faster. Hey, um, so yeah, just go back and forth. You're gonna keep going back and forth, Eric, until you don't see any water coming up. When you don't see any water coming up, that means that you picked up the bulk of the water out of the ground. Then you go to the next spot. Repeat the process, soap cycle, soap cycle, then the rinse cycle, rinse cycle is clean water, and last, suction. Keep going over that spot until you don't see any more water coming up. All right, so that is the Aquamate, and that is the shampooer, all right? So the next one that I'm gonna show you, put it right on over here, push this, all right. Next one I'm going to show you is the mop for the hardwood floor. All right, so what I did, I'm going to bring it over so you can see. All right, I got you three sets of heads. I got you the, this is for the wood floors. It has the two pads. All right, and then this one is for tile. So you can scrub and then you squeegee the water out of the ground. Okay, so that one, what I'm going to do is show you which one first, the wood floor attachment. So this has its own pipe. See how it has the metal pipe? So you only need one more of the metal pipe. I'll show you. All right, so see, I took one pipe out, one pipe off. This is the other pipe. Go like that, put it on there, it's ready to go. And then this guy right here, I'll show you. Put that there. These are Velcro uh, pads. I gave you two of them, so you could do literally, you could do half a house with one, half a house with the other. All right, so which, and these are washable, so you don't have to replace these. And they're Velcro, so you lay it down on the ground. All right, and what you do is you do this, lay it down, and it's ready. That's the setup. Now the bottle right here is gonna come off. So what you do is you pull it off, and you're gonna put water almost to the top, okay? And then you're gonna, I left you some cleaner solution. If you want more, I can, I, I have some in the car, the 25 for, for like a jug, but it's concentrate. So you put a cap full into there, and then you close it. That's the setup. All right, and ready, what you do, put it back, give it a little tap, give it a little tap, then the O-ring grabs, okay? Press the trigger, and you're gonna see the water being released, so it's like a sprayer right here. So what's cool is you got total control right here. So this is for wood floors, so you uh, put it on the wood floors, and you give it a sheen, and then you give it a shine. So you go back and forth, and then go to the next one, just go back and forth, Put as much as you want on the ground, on the wood floors. Any excess, it will suck up into the machine. It's able to suck up right through there, okay? Whenever you're shampooing, whenever you're mopping, start empty in the water reservoir because you're actually sucking water into, into the bowl, all right? So that's the Velcro pad. The only difference with the uh, squeegee, all right, for tile. This is for tile floors, all right? Nylon bristles. You can see them, they're, it's like you're getting on your hands and knees, but you're not getting on your hands and knees. So this is for tile floors. Same thing, what you do, start empty, press the trigger, you're gonna see the water come out. So what you do is you spray, 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 scrub, 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 and then look, what you do, turn it, pull towards you. And what it does is sucks the water into the machine. So that's for your tile floors, all right? I also gave you this one too. That's for the initial, that you want for, for scrubbing, all right? Initially, you wanna use that one. Later, a few weeks later, then you can use the sponge head. But the sponge head has the squeegee as well. So same thing, you pop it on there, uh, spray, 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 lather, lather, turn it, always pull towards you and the squeegee right there sucks the water right up into the machine. All right, so that's the mop setup. All right, this is some of the uh, floor cleaner uh, solution right now. It has a squirt bottle in it. So once you almost fill it to the top, give it like five, six squirts, and that's for cleaning. But I do have the concentrate you want to get that have that in the car. All right. And then the next one that I wanted to show you, all right, is the mini shampooer. This will do the stairs, and this will do cars, but you got brand new furniture. It actually does furniture as well. So if something spills, you can real quick suck the stain up immediately. Okay, so that's the, this one right on over here, I'll show you. Okay, this actually has its own hose. All right, I'll show you. So this has its own hose. So this is the mini jack. So this is for spot cleaning. So if you have one little spot, go for the stairs. You can do this the stair shampoo the stairs. The only difference with this is you gotta take the tool holder off. 
to the tool holder. You gotta take this one off and it's really on there so you gotta really pull it because the hose will not go on there unless the tool caddy is off. So same thing, just lay there. And then this is the, has a 10 foot hose. So you could do the, the uh, almost to the top with this one. But if not, whatever you can't reach, go from the top and then come down. And then you have one of these already with, with your rainbow. You should have one. And then what you do is that's the, the button you press. So what that does, that sprays the water right out. So you spray, 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 spray. And then tuck, shut the machine off, scrub, scrub, and then you'll, you can suck the stain out once you turn the machine on. All right, this comes off too, so you can clean that as well. All right, so it's the same uh, thing. This uses the copper shampoo solution. All right, so what you do is you fill it to the top and then put a cap hold of the soap in there. All right, so that's the uh, mini uh, jet. Put that one right here. And I think that is it. And then this is the uh, solution. I gave you a bottle of the shampoo.